almost done. I've gotten four, five of the six areas done and there's some, these two have a gap, but I think I'll have enough left over to fill that in. This one have a big gap, so it's the one in the back. But I bought 10 of these two by four, two foot by four foot sheets. And that's gotten me this far and this is the leftovers, right? So five big rectangles from them and then a skinny piece from where this rib's skinnier than two feet. So yeah, and I did, I'm doing a Super 90. So it was about a hundred bucks in foam because it was on sale and then $50 in this stuff because I don't think I'll need the fourth can. So if someone else wanted to do the same thing I'm doing, uh, get your purple sick ass foam on sale and you can do it all in for like 150. So I got the mower out there doing its thing. I'll do a video about that later, but vroom. So uh, purple everywhere. It's amazing. And now I'm putting up, I pulled these down off the other van. They're still sticky enough. They just stick right up. And they have these, all these cut points, right? Every looks like three LEDs. And what you can do is you can buy a bunch of the cable yeah, and then they make these connect. Can I what? More beer. Uh, no, I don't need more beer yet. He's getting be beers out of the fridge. Um, Anyway, so for this particular one, this is 10 millimeter wide, and so you just buy 10 millimeter wide clips. And this side clips to the cable end, and this one with the holes in it clips to the cable, cable, not the ribbon, or whatever you want to call it. So this doesn't even really, well, you probably want it up flat like this, right? It'll be easier to put on, which has blue on the left and 12 volt on the right. Black is the 12 volt. So you have blue, red, green, Oops, frame. You just push these all the way in, right? And there's blades that stick through, like those are really horrible car connectors. And of course, it's here. Probably should get some pliers and pull it together because it should click into place. Let me find those. So, in here. Um, that click. I mean, it's flat. It's not pulling out, so that should be good. And then the other side, it's blue on the bottom. Oops, should just slide it. What, Harrison? This one doesn't have the cap twisted on. No. Mm -mm. Well, you can drink it. As I said so. Oops. <laughs> give us a think. Come to this side where it's easier to see. Or here. Here's one that I haven't stuck on yet. So I think these, I feel like the contact should go towards it. So it should go in like this. So I may have done that wrong on the last one. Oh, Daddy. What, Harrison? Daddy, orange juice. Orange juice? Okay, so, which makes my cable on this side have wrong. This juice when I'm having or does it go juice. through it? I'm gonna try it this way and see what happens. You can have that juice because it's already open, Harrison. Why? Yeah, it looks like it actually punches through. Oh, it definitely punches through the other side. So hopefully that works. It's lined up blue green with a 12 volt. And actually, you can find out because this is the one that has the end on it. So I'll hook the little controller up and we'll test the short strip. Wait, no hooks to this end, so of course it's gonna work. Uh, no. Stop. I'll figure something out. Oh, look at that. Works. Got lights. So each rib has a set of lights. Uh, Gotta go hang out with my buddy for his birthday, and then it'll be dark, hopefully, when we get back or close to it, and we can see how they look. Boom. Oh, red, because it's Harrison's favorite. But I did reset my number one setting. So this is, like, the most white I can make it. And there's a weird purple spot. There's a couple purple spots where clearly part of it's not working, but I need my shot. The lights are great. It's a nice, even light. I can see everything, and if we really want to match the eggshell foam, purple. Yeah, 
Maybe it looks blue on video. There, that's more purple. That's where we're going to leave it.